Oh, baby, they cannot keep us apart any longer. <laughs> no It's more. been too long, my Zola. <laughs> we are in the kitchen to spread some Christmas cheer, and this looks like a ridiculously simple recipe. I suppose Christmas, we want to draw people into the home, and Absolutely. what draws people into the home more than the smell of baking cookies? They say that if you want to sell your house, you should bake some cookies. Oh, man. Hey? Well, selling or not, we're going to bake some <laughs> sugar cookies. Okay, what okay. are we making this Okay, morning? so this isn't my recipe. This is Sh Chef Sherwin's recipe. He just got stuck in traffic, so I, uh, I'm filling in, so hopefully I do his recipe some justice. I have no doubt. Okay, it is very simple though. Festive mm. su sugar cookies, fun to do with the kids and fun to do with the whole family actually. So it starts with some softened butter. So you're going to stir. You know when you cook with me, you got to go to yeah, work, yeah. right? Yeah, do I go with the wooden spoon with first? With the wooden eh? spoon yeah. is good. So okay. make sure the butter is soft. So it you looks stir very it around soft. a bit. And we're yeah, using no, salati white sugar. You could also use some salati caster snow. Okay. Um, but everyone has sort of white sugar or brown sugar at hand that they use for their tea. So you cool. can use it for the cookies as well. So you cream together the sugar and the butter. And this, don't be shy with the sugar. Sugar, no? Don't be shy with the sugar. They are sugar cookies after exactly. all. Exactly. Okay. But you want and to add that caramel snap as while well. While you stir, time. I'm going to add some vanilla for flavor. Nice. Okay. And then I'm going to stir in the eggs. Well, you're going to stir in the <laughs> eggs a little at a time, just all so right. it doesn't curdle. And to prevent it curdling, you can actually just add a bit of egg. And then I'm going to mix together the dry ingredients. So we've got some baking powder, some um, bicarb, um, and some salt all right. going into the flour. Cool. Okay, and then to prevent it from, from curdling, you add a bit of the flour, a bit of the egg, and you alternate, okay? Okay. And then what you want to do once you've mixed this together to form a dough, which will happen in a few because mm -hmm. we've got mussels, Graham over here, yeah. stirring. Thank you for that. Um, oops, and making a mess. Yeah, as, as one should. Well, <laughs> you, you did know. say we can do it with the kids. You can do it with so the I'm kids. So I'm going to represent for the kids. Thank you. Okay, so then I'm going to add the rest of the flour. Cool. And then you just mix it until it forms a dough. And then what you want to do is chill it in the fridge for about 30 minutes. Make sure you okay. cover the dough, okay? Yeah, and it's Wrap quite, it a, quite a dry dough, eh? Hey? It is dry because it, you do want it to be a dough at the end, okay? And again, because you want that snap, that you do. real you snap want that in your snap. cookie. You yeah, cool. There we go. Here. Okay, then you rest it in the fridge for about 30 minutes. Cool. Um, and then you roll it out about a centimetre thick. So this is rolled out. All right, so and then you can you choose any festive cookie cutter. Nice. So we've got stars here, you can do Christmas trees. We've got some reindeer, we've got some <laughs> angels. Some slightly over overweight Over reindeer. You know, There's a fat reindeer is cute after all. <laughs> okay, so then you just cut them out, pop them onto a grease tray, and then we bake them at 180 degrees for about uh, 15 minutes, about 12 to 15 minutes. Just make sure that they start going brown at the edge. Okay. And the cookies become cookie like. And I see you've got about like a half a centimetre or almost a centimetre. Almost a centimetre, you don't want, it, yeah. you don't thin, want yeah? it too thin, otherwise they'll break up and stuff. And also, if you're nice... doing it with the kids, it's better that way. Cool. And then, once your cookies are cooled, you can decorate. So, do you want green or white? This is just some oh, icing green. sugar. Some green, icing, thanks. sorry. Made with, you, you start icing. Cool. Um, we've got some um, Salati icing snow. So, this is the, the fine sugar, okay? It All dissolves right. very quickly. And then a bit of lemon juice. Just a little at cool. a time until it makes. Um, nice. a, a sort of piping consistency. I made mistletoe. Look at oh, that. That's pretty good, eh? That was a snowman until you put uh, mistletoe he's got, he's on now his, got a mistletoe <laughs> on his bottom. Um, a little scarf so around yeah, so his neck. So you can neck. put it into piping bags, you can drizzle with a spoon, however you like, and then just decorate with the kids. And then a, a bit more icing snow over the top gives it a snowy effect, and there you go. Festive oh, cookies. Oh, festive indeed. Well, if you want to see how we created these beautiful little items of festive cheer, let's take a quick look at a recap. Cream butter and sugar until smooth. Beat in eggs one at a time. Add baking powder, flour and salt. Chill dough in the fridge for an hour. Roll dough out and cut shapes out. Bake for 10 minutes. For the icing, mix icing sugar and lemon juice. For the full recipe, visit the Expresso Morning Show Facebook page or log on to www.expressoshow.com. SMS the keyword SALATI to 33728 to receive the shopping list on your phone. Click on the link provided to view the recipe. SMSs cost 1 Rand 50, no free SMSs. T's and C's apply. Oh, nicely done, Zola. Well done. I think Sherwin would be very impressed. Um, but thank you very much. That keyword again is Salati to double three seven two eight. Salati to double three seven two eight. You'll be sent a link to get the recipe directly on your phone. It's going to cost you just one rand fifty to send that SMS. Zoe, thank you so much, sweetheart.